Hi guys, I'm going to take the side panel off so we can have a look at that gear on the end of the rotor shaft. I've taken two, three screws out already. It's worth noting they're not all the same, so I'll have to be careful and remember which ones go where. Yeah, quite a selection of different screws there. Still, that now lifts off. We can have a look at the gear. You can see it's another one with a threaded yeah, screw through the side of it, which no doubt is supposed to align with a hole in that shaft again. Alright, we'll have a look at that. Alright, if I turn the rotor and hold the gear, you can see it's just sliding. It's not gripping at all. This is turning out to be a complete mess, isn't it? Right, that's what I'm looking at there. And it, now I can see it. it looks like it's a slot that this hole and screw that goes in it has got to line up with that slot. So, up there it was just a hole in the side of the shaft that the screw had to align with. Down here it looks like it's a slot. While we've got it open we can see the wear on these teeth a little bit easier. I mean it's not terrible but it's certainly not helping. I've put the screw back in, hopefully it's aligned with that slot. So we'll put it all back together and give it a try. While we've got it apart, I suppose we could just have a quick look. So we've got the motor, pinion gear, driving an intermediate gear that's a reduction, small to big to small to big. And then we've got exactly the same at the other end for the top rotor. Pinion gear on the shaft of the motor, to a big gear, to a smaller gear, to another big gear. And that's my LiPo battery taped in place. Before I put the side panel back on again, I've just noticed how warped this gear is. If I just put this under here as a gauge, so it's just touching it at the moment, It's now got a bit of clearance and then it's rubbing against it again. So clearance there and then rubbing against it there. Clear, rubbing. So it's actually going warped up and down. I assume that's probably accident damage at some time or other. So at least it seems to be gripping at the moment. So I'll put the panel back on, see if I can figure out which screw goes where. All right, let's see what happens this time.
Well, it's still turning the gear. We've still got that stiff spot, which I think is where the gear is warped. So, we're going to have to go and try it again. Maybe it won't rain this time. <laughs> Maybe.